they set out to develop a high grip glue, but it completely failed. They eventually made hundreds of millions of dollars. Problems. We all wish we didn't have them, but we all seem to have a lot of them. Problems arise all the time in respect of the relationship between hospitals and physicians with contracts of any kind, from exclusives to co-management deals. Someone finds a partially used vial of drugs that was not properly disposed of, or there is a complaint about responsiveness in terms of responding to referring physicians, or there's tussles with hospital staff about getting an add-on case onto the OR schedule. It's what you do about a problem that makes the difference. Ignoring it is a fool's game. The, the problem will fester. Solving the problem is neutral. You think you're back on an even keel, but chances are that there's still lingering anger. Most medical groups view problems tactically. The problem happened. Now what? Accept responsibility. Ignore it and hope it goes away. Blame it on someone else. But when viewed strategically, most problems are opportunities. I'm not talking simply frame of mind as in every problem is an opportunity in disguise. Rather, problems are the fuel for opportunity. I'm talking actual opportunity, a situation that can be flipped and made through very fast filtering through your group's overall strategy, followed by very fast deployment of a conforming tactic back to the source or relevant third party. The partially used vial leads to development of a new disposal protocol. The lack of responsiveness leads to co-development of new tools for closer collaboration, and so on. When a problem of this sort next occurs for your practice, think what advantage can be gained. I call the strategy the situation transformer. To do this effectively requires that the advantage be viewed through the lens of overall group strategy which means that you have to have one, and that you have the ability to respond quickly. It's making lemons into lemonade. Or, in the case of the glue that didn't grip, it's making it into Post-it brand notes.